Hello everyone, it's Eagle of Zeus here again, and this video is going to be talking about um, how to get started with Hellenic polytheism if you're a beginner. Um, a lot of people, you know, when they first start out with Hellenic polytheism, one of the main questions they ask is, how do I start? How do I get started? Um, so I'm going to be reading off of a Tumblr answer I wrote because somebody asked me the same thing on Tumblr, so I'm going to be reading um, my response to them. So if I keep looking down, it's because I'm reading off of what I said to them. Um, so if you're new to Hellenism, you know, you're interested in it, you feel a calling to it, and you want to know, um, you know, how to get started. So what I said, um, this is my advice of for getting started is the main thing you need to do is read read about the religion um i would recommend really focusing on history and you know what the ancient greeks believed you know how they worshiped how they practiced and that way you can really see if Hellenic polytheism is right for you. Um, you know, look into the ancient Greeks, um, ideologies, philosophies, their, um, you know, values, things that they valued in life and, you know, and just the way that they worshipped and things like that. So I would definitely recommend doing historical research, um, but, you know, of course, also do research on how modern practitioners practice as well. But by knowing how ancient practitioners practiced, you have you already have a good idea how modern practitioners practice, at least for Reconstructionists. Um, so reading is definitely important. Um, a lot of people, I feel, you know, they, they ask, how do I get started? And they want somebody to mentor them or, you know, to teach them step by step how to get started. But really reading for yourself is the best thing you can do to learn about the religion. Just read, read about it for yourself. Um, because in the end, it's your practice. You need to develop it, you know, you need to develop your own practice so it'll fit your life. Um... You know, everyone's practices are different. Um, we all base our practice off of the same thing, which is ancient Greek religion, but the way we practice the ancient Greek religion is different. Um, so definitely read about the religion for yourself. Um, I recommend buying books. Um, and I made a list here of some book recommendations, and I've made a couple videos. Um, but... Let's see, the, the books here I listed are Caris and Comos, which I've shown in my videos, and Hellenic Polytheism Household Worship, which I've shown in video. I think I've shown, yeah, I've shown all of these in my previous videos about um, book books I recommend. And then also Hellenic Polytheism, A Personal Guide for Ancient Greek Practitioners, A Beginner's Guide to Hellenismos, Hellenismos, Practicing Greek Polytheism Today, and those are the ones I recommended. Um, and I'll put a link to this Tumblr answer in the description so you guys can see the titles for yourself. And I, I also showed them what they look like in my uh, recommended book videos, so you can check those out too. And then I also listed some websites that I recommend checking out. Um, a lot of people are going to tell you about this blog, um, Bearing the Aegis. It's a great blog. It's Bearing the Aegis at blogspot.com. Um, a really informative blog. It's written by a, a reconstructionist. So I would definitely recommend Bearing the Aegis at blogspot.com. Also Hellenion, which is the largest American Hellenic polytheism group um 
so their website has a lot of good information. If you're a paid member, you'll get more information, but they have a lot of good information on their website, you know, for free. And then also, um, HellenicGods.org is a good resource as well. Um, and then also the Theoi.com. Theoi.com is more specifically about the gods and mythology. They also have a lot of, um, they have like a e-library that has a lot of hymns and, um, literature on there to check out. Uh, but it, it mainly focuses on, like, about the gods themselves and um, mythology. But it's a really great site. I would definitely recommend it. Um, and then I also wanted to talk about Amino, which is an app. If you go to the app store and you search up Amino, you should get an app called Amino. Um, I think it's called... I think it's just called Amino, but it's known as the Amino community, and pretty much, like, there's different communities on Amino that, you know, that focus on different uh, fandoms or different groups, like religions, things like that, but there's a um, Hellenic polytheism Amino um, that I'm a member of called Hellenistic polytheism Amino, and I'm actually a curator on there. And it's a really great Amino, a really good community, friendly, welcoming community, um, you know, great leadership team that, and you can ask questions there. And we also have a wiki with a lot of good information on there that you could check out. So I would recommend joining if, if you can download the Amino app. Um, and then of course, YouTube, YouTube is a good resource too, to learn, um, of course, I'm not the only Hellenic Polytheism channel on here. You can just search up Hellenic Polytheism and you can find other videos. Um, I think, um, Barring the Aegis, or, um, Alini? Alani? I think her name's Alani. Uh, she has a, a YouTube channel, um, and she has a few videos up. And, um, there's also Chris Aldridge, who I've talked about in, in previous videos. He's a Hellenic priest. He has his own temple in Illinois called Temple of the Greek Gods. Um, and he's written a few books that I've shown on my channel. Um, but he also has a YouTube channel as well as a website, which I put the link to his website in this um, answer. But yeah, I would recommend his channel and you can find a lot of good channels on here to, to learn. Um, but really, um, you know, just approach the gods, you know, just pray to the gods, give offerings in your own way, how you feel is right. And, you know, just meditate and try communicating with them and, you know, pray and give offerings and... You know, and it doesn't have to be anything expensive or fancy or anything elaborate. You know, just get to know the gods. That's the main, you know, that's the main thing you can do. Just, you know, if you're just getting started and you want to learn about the religion, you know, read about it. Um, and just, you know, pray to the gods and get to know the gods. Start forming a relationship with them and, um, you know get close with them and give offerings, meditate, pray, you know, in your own way and just take things slow. This is the most important. Take things slow. You know, there's no rush. Just take things one step at a time. Focus on one area of study at a time. Don't try and take in all the information at once because Hellenic polytheism is a, you know, pretty complex religion especially if you're going to be a reconstructionist you you know you're going to have to do a lot of historical research so you know definitely take things one step at a time take things slow you know and you know there's nothing wrong with asking questions and learning from others but in the end you need to form your own practice and you know um you know practice the way that's best for you, you know, it's, it's good not to copy somebody else's practice because their practice may not work for you. So in the end, you know, only you can, 
decide what practice works for you. So, you know, and your practice is most likely going to change as you grow and learn. I mean, my practice now isn't how it was when I first started out. And, you know, but just take things slow and just, you know, pray how you feel is right. Give offerings, you know, give whatever offerings you feel the gods would like. And, you know, just get to know the gods and just take it slow, read, learn. You know, I mean, that's pretty much how you get started. You just learn and read and get to know the gods. So, I hope this video was helpful and informative. And, like I said, I'm going to post the link to this answer that I wrote in the description. So you guys can actually, like, read it and, you know, see the answers I wrote. And see the links to all the websites that I um, that I listed. Um, so anyway, I guess that's about it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, and may the gods bless you.